Uh, greetings, everyone. Uh, if you are a holder of the Zimbabwe exemption permit, and at some point you once had an Aslam document, and you surrendered it in 2010 in favor of a four-year permit then, <coughs> known as the TZP, which is now known as the ZEP, you cannot go back to the Aslam document. Because an Aslam document is a document that is given to a person that is seeking refuge. Uh, the person will be running away from persecution, whether it will be based on their political beliefs or religious beliefs or any other <coughs> persecution that might put your life in risk if you return to your country of origin. So if you surrender the Aslam document in 2010 and then now you cannot move to other visa and you know that in the last 12 years we have been traveling to Zimbabwe, you cannot then apply for an Aslam document because by surrendering the Aslam document in 2010, you were forfeiting your right to be granted a refugee status but if for some reason again which is problematic but if for some reason you then uh, abandoned your Aslam application at the time and then he went on to get a, a permit uh, you have never traveled to Zimbabwe Again, you cannot apply for an Aslam for the following reasons. Uh, the main one being that uh, the, the Zimbabwean passport has a lifespan of 10 years. So assuming you got your passport in 2010 and uh, then applied for a permit, it means your passport would have expired in 2020 or if it was issued in 2011, early 2011, again, your passport would have expired in 2021. So if you then renewed the passport, meaning you went to the Zimbabwean consulate, be it in Johannesburg or Cape Town, to collect the form, by entering the Zimbabwean consulate, it meant that you had entered Zimbabwe, because if you are at the consulate, you are on Zimbabwean soil. So if you are wanted by the government of Zimbabwe, you then go to any of the Zimbabwean consulate. The government of Zimbabwe will arrest you at the consulate. So again, you cannot say, no, I never traveled to Zimbabwe in the last 12 years, but you were able to renew your passport, it means you cannot travel. You cannot then go back to the Aslam document. So there are others who are saying, uh, can we then move back to the Aslam document because we surrendered the Aslam documents in 2010. Uh, now we are unable to move to other visas. How possible is it? It is not possible to move to, a, to the Aslam document because you abandoned that route in 2010, 12 years ago, and you are now uh, in the uh, uh, special permit regime, as it were. So we need uh, just to clarify this so that uh, there is no confusion. We will, uh, hopefully, this coming week, uh, uh, be able to inquire more on the waiver because a lot of people are still asking questions and we said in the last video that uh, we sometimes not respond because we don't have answers. But we hope to get uh, feedback uh, in the coming week uh, on the waivers application, particularly those that are domestic workers and so forth, uh, to say how do you apply for a waiver if you are a domestic worker or do you qualify? That is, if you are a domestic worker, you work in the hospitality industry, and Uber driver and so forth. So we are trying to get that information for you. We had again promised that in the month of September we will respond on the Provident Fund and other benefits. But in light of the extension 
of the grace period to 30th of June uh, 2023, we kind of ex uh, extended that. We think the critical thing at this stage is to deal with the issue of a waiver so that everyone who is a hold of ZEP can apply. Once we deal with all these issues, we can then uh, uh, try to get more information on how one applies for their benefits if they want to relocate back to Zimbabwe. Uh, so stay tuned in this YouTube channel. Make sure you subscribe, you click the notice button so that when we then come back to you, uh, particularly on the waiver issues, uh, you will be the first one to know. Uh, otherwise, thank you so much. Um, uh, please subscribe to this YouTube to this YouTube channel. Please circulate your contacts. Otherwise, goodbye.